All right, people, I finally found the time to do this type of video and show it to you because many of you are still asking me, Berbs, how can I improve my touches? So here it is, simple as that. You need a ball and a wall, and then you train your balance, your mobility, your agility, your speed, your reaction time, your technique, your touches, everything you need in football. Also, I wanted you to see this because not everything is perfect all the time. I have a couple of bad touches here as well, but the important thing is that after that, straight away, I know how to react and make it look good. Look at this. Bam, bad touch, but straight away I know how to kick the ball and to make it look good. In football, it's important to know in every situation exactly what type of touch to use. Wow, and the ball, episode two people. Straight away I'm showing you some of my favorite touches and the way to train them. First one is by far my favorite one. I was doing it a lot in the games and I show it to you twice here, second time in slow motion so you can appreciate the difficulty of the touch because in football you never know when the ball is gonna come flying at you full speed so you need to be ready. And I was practicing back then by kicking the ball hard in the wall and then this forced me straight away to start thinking on my feet how to control the ball how to turn away from the ball but still be able to control it how to follow the ball with my eyesight how to position my body in the way to dance with the ball and then when i control it to still be in the position to start playing and this way training my touch my vision everything next one is kicking the ball high and just control it i was doing this all my life and then in the game you'll be able to do stuff like this it looks easy but that comes after you train the right way. All right, people, another episode bow and a wall. I'm outside my house. I just finished washing my car. Yes, I washed my car. Why? Because if you want something to be done the right way, you do it yourself, okay? <laughs> and then a bit of football. I wanted to show you this exercise. It's very simple again, but very effective. You just try to keep the ball in the air while hitting the wall. That's it. This way, you train your touch. You train how to stop the ball when it's coming towards you in a different angles. Everything that is happening in the game, all right? From time to time, you go closer to the wall. This is different. And then you go back a bit more of a distance. It's going to make it more challenging for you. Don't get fooled by the weather. It's very cold. It's like five degrees. All right. So this is advice to all young players. It doesn't matter the weather, snow, rain, cold. You go out there and start practicing. Have some fun. All right. But don't forget what is important and what helps you in the game. The first touch. See you later.